happy holidays. It's officially Christmas time, and the first thing I think of when I think of Christmas is Christmas cookies. Now, I've been making Christmas cookies since I was a little girl, so I figured I'm in a new house, we have this brand new kitchen in a new state, why not make some Christmas cookies this year? But I have a lot of catching up to do, so we are gonna make a lot of Christmas cookies. Stir it until it becomes something. One really good thing about the holidays is being able to spend time with family. As in, when you are not strong enough to knead your own dough, you get your mom to do it. <laughs> Christmas memories has to be going to my Aunt Adele's Christmas Eve parties. They are so much fun. What we look forward to every year because it's when all of our family just gets together and we just have a great time and that's what we are missing most this year. It's really hard. Santa Claus comes, all the kids get presents, we play one of those uh, Pollyanna white elephant games. Last Christmas, I was in Orlando, and I did get to go to the Osborne Lights. I can't forget how happy I was that night. I felt invincible, I felt strong, I felt love and joy and everything that you should feel on Christmas, I felt at the Osborne Lights. It's just such a beautiful experience. My first Christmas not at home was in 2011 when I was doing the Disney College program. My whole family came and visited me and I bought them all matching shirts, and I don't know if they appreciated it, but I loved it. We did Mickey's Very Merry Christmas Party with the special parade and the sugar cookies and the hot chocolate, and it was just really nice to have them. We even set up a little Christmas tree at the Key West in our room. Another really good holiday memory is neighbor Dominique has a lunch meet party every Christmas night and it's really nice to like relax and eat sandwiches and just be with, well they're with family, but they're technically our family I would, yeah, they're family, but it's nice and we're really going to miss that. I wish they were here. We wish we were there. I was really young and I was watching TV in my parents room by myself. I looked under their bed and I found this amazing tag this big and it said to Michael and Anna from Santa. It was beautiful. I'm pretty sure there was glitter on it. Whatever you dream of a tag from Santa as and triple that in size, that's what it was. It was beautiful. Obviously, I asked my mom and dad, like, why would Santa come to our house early? Why is there a tag here? My mom said that Santa was so busy that he had to drop it off early. That way he could get everything done by Christmas. I did see that tag under the tree, and it just happened to be a trampoline, which was so much fun. We really loved it. Moms are great at also not only filming you whenever you ask her to, but also for fixing your stuff when you mess up. Okay, it's not. Another really good Christmas memory I have is actually when I was in Florida, again, doing the college program. I was closing at the Emporium, which was a really late night, and all of a sudden I hear all this music. And we all look outside and the streets are empty, but then we see the parade, the Christmas parade, practicing at night and no one was in their costumes yet, um, but it was a really cool experience and at the very end, Santa was there and we were all screaming like, yeah, Santa! Um, we also got to see, while we were closing the Emporium, the first night that they practiced laying in the castle and we all snuck outside actually, we unlocked the doors to the Emporium, we walked on Main Street and it's really magical to be able to share that with so many other people. Another memory actually at Disney 
that I have is, again, at the Emporium. I was going down to the Chilador and I saw Santa and I screamed, Santa! Because it's Christmas, I mean, it's Santa! And I was really embarrassed, but I think he gave me like a Snickers bar or something. So I got to meet Santa, you know, it's not a big deal. The first time that my grandparents met me was actually on Christmas Eve because I was born December 16th, so that's kind of a nice little Christmas present. When I was very little, my mom used to take me and my brother to the North Pole. She would make us get in the car, we'd close our eyes, they would go over uh, railroad tracks and you know, say that we're flying to the North Pole, when in reality it was uh, Pittman, New Jersey to see like all the houses decorated and uh, I still went as an adult. It's, it's really cute and everyone really gets into it. They... Now, the best gift that I think that I've ever given was our puppy Joey. Got my mom a puppy for Christmas because our dog Rusty passed away and she said she never wanted another dog. Me and my dad thought it would be a great idea to get her a puppy for Christmas. We saw the litter of puppies and I immediately loved Joey. He was the smallest puppy and my mom hated him. She kept calling him that effing dog and stupid dog. She did not love him. And it's funny because we couldn't see our lives without Joey. I would not be able to live in California if it wasn't for him. I sleep with him every night. He calms me down every night. If I'm crying, he's there. If I'm, if I'm in pain, he's there. Anything, he's there. And I know my, my dad and my mom feel the same way. And so I'm really glad I got him. He's no longer a pet effing dog. We all love him. The cookies are done. <laughs> They're beautiful. <laughs> They're not bad. <laughs> There's all the jimmies. <laughs> so much for watching. I really enjoyed baking all these things. You know, the holidays are really hard when you're not in your normal situation when you're not with family, even if you are with family, things are hard and the way I dealt with them today is to bake four different things. I made these crazy pink Jimmy filled sugar cookies, I made Jeer Deli dark chocolate chip cookies, I made these peanut butter with uh, Reese's Cups cookies, and I made a s'mores bar which I'm sure is going to taste delicious as soon as I try it. So that's, you know my Christmas preparation. I hope your Christmas is as sweet as ours is gonna be. Thanks so much, we miss everyone. Thank you so much.